Hello. In my videos, I always explain what and how can you do something. Okay, now I will explain what you can't do in Microsoft Project. That comes from uh, my uh, question from one of my uh, uh, blog readers. I quit it with blog when I started with vlog. But anyhow, he asked me, is there possibility to have a fixed cost for resource over the month? Okay, so it says, okay, I want to have, for example, resource in each and every task to which I will assign him, and that that resource have, for example, 4,000 US dollars per month, no matter if the task will have 25 duration, 15 day, days duration, or only, let's say, one day duration. So let's say that I have task three, and I have one day duration, okay, and I say here, okay, it will be like that. So you will see, let's say that, that this, is, uh, this is my, uh, my schedule, and I will decrease this one and in two days. So you can see that I have here, in, in, uh, uh, in ta for task one, it goes from uh, June to July. Task two is only in July, and task three is in July as well. So what my, uh, my uh, uh, blog reader wants, he wants that, for example, for this task, and this task together, it, they should be uh, $8,000. Why? Because something is done in, in June, something is done in July. It is not possible. Well, he tried here to put 4000 per month. And now let's go here and let's assign John to all of those three tasks. Okay, John, and now John, and now John, and you will see that I have different types of uh, 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 different costs. How those costs are calculated when I have standard rate 4,000 US dollars per month? Let me show you that. So for this task, I have 5,000 for this task, 40, uh, 400 for this task, 1,200 and uh, 200, and let's say that this, this is 10 days. Now, let me show you how this is calculated. First of all, go, uh, first of all let's go to resource sheet. John, is, his standard rate is 4,000 US dollar per month. He is working on this task 25, on this 10, and on this one day. Now, let me show you how is the calculation done. In File, Options, Schedule, you see that days per month are 20. So basically, here is said that one month in 20 days. Since John has $4,000 per month. It means, let me bring up calculator, that he will have 4,000 divided by 20 days is his standard rate per day is 200. Okay, 200. Let me memorize this. Okay, now 200 is standard rate. Now, these 200 multiplied by 25 days for task one leads us to 5,000 US dollars. These 200 multiplied by 10 days it lead us to $2,000. And of course, if one, two, two, uh, $200 per day uh, multiplied by one is 200. That's how it is calculated. But oh, what? Uh, how can uh, uh, we achieve what, what my blog, read, uh, blog readers wants to have 
thousand US dollars per month per resource, no matter how many days are spent in a month. There is no way to do that. Okay? There is no way to do that. Because he told me, well, I have fixed salary, okay? And I have a salary for my uh, my employee, which is here, John and Mary here, and it is four thousand per month. And I want to know that he is going to have four thousand per month. No, it is not possible, except if you go task by task and say, okay, this task is from uh, uh, the only one in June, and I will put it here. Okay, fixed costs. I will go here, and I will say, okay, costs, I will put here 4,000. Now, let's, 4,000, sorry. Now, let's go back to, get, uh, to entry table, and this task goes from, uh, uh, from July only to uh, on July. Let me put here, okay, 4,000 as well. Okay, 4,000, so. And let's go to task three, and let's see. Task three is only in July, but I, I already put July here, and I have here for uh, 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 4,000 as well. But for this purpose, I should put that standard rate is zero, and I will get here in Gantt chart what I wanted. But this is very annoying. Because you should be careful in this case. Okay, task one is, is June and July. Do I have any other task in June? No. So it is 4,000 uh, 4, in June, but I have another task in July. I will put it here. And this third task is all in July, and I, I'm not going to put anything here because I put it here. So it will complicate your life. To be, be aware, if you want to have fixed cost per source, no matter how much tasks does it have, or how, uh, uh, how long the task is, is it goes through one month, two months, three months, it is not possible. Okay, hope this helps. Thank you very much. Goodbye.